Never a dull day. Never a dull day. What a boy. No, 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 sweet child of mine. That one escapes every single day. Hey, what? We're getting through that grass. Ooh, you'll know about this now. I've been keeping it a secret. Look, it's here. I oh, know, I'm a loser. Good morning, everyone. If you have not already, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, ring the little bell. Videos every Tuesday, Friday, and sometime. We do the Sunday video. Grass is getting short, the weather's getting rubbish, and we need to move from stock. We need to move um, Neptune and the heifers, so that's gonna be exciting. And we've got the Highlands in that group as well. So I don't know how well this is gonna go. I don't know how well this is gonna go. We're moving them across the road. And if you know anything about our road, people don't like us moving stock on the road because it slows them down and they have to wait. It's not a long wait. Hey guys! People hate waiting because people are not patient anymore at all. We moved some last year, it wasn't too bad. But we have had years where people have kicked off to the max. We've got myself, and this is the right way of saying it. We've got Heidi, Ben, Father and I. There we go, look, I'm learning. Right, let's go shout them up, get some cows, move some cows. It's wet. It's really wet. Oh, wasn't expecting that to be so easy. Should have worn more clothes. It's freezing. You know when you've had a lot of rain, when the weir's doing that. I'm pretty sure it's got a weir. Not good. Holy moly. That is a lot of water. So that shut there. Those two gates are open because I'm going to try and put them through the gate on the right, which is a bit smaller because I'm less timed on the road. It's like I say, everyone hates this movie stock on our road because it's so busy. This field on the left is where Neptune stays with the heifers. And you can just see it's starting to get tread up. Maybe just short of 30 around that kind of mark in this field on about 18, 12-ish, 30 acres. So they've got an acre of cow, but you can see where I've been feeding them. It's a mess. You would not believe that you could walk across that in your slippers probably seven days ago. The amount of rain we've had in five days since Saturday, and today is Friday, so six days, seven days, whatever, seven days. It's just the amount of water. I've got a little bit of a surprise from Pete from Cars Billington. He has uh, said, Tom, I've seen that something happened. A little bit of a present. I dropped something off. Team have arrived. Time to let some stock out. I was going to drone it, but then Heidi and I, that's the second time we've done it, she just corrected me. <laughs> we just thought it'd be too much stress. This was a hard work last time, so I'm going to GoPro it all. We'll get him out here. I'll phone dad first. Make sure he's right. Are you ready-ish? Well, no, I've not even got him out of the field yet. I'll start getting him out now, and then you'll see Ben down the end. I'll have a look. No. We'll get him into that pasture first, and we can sort him out later, can't we? We've got the time. Right, okay, put the phone down on me. That was good. Come on, loves. This is your mate from last year. Donkey. Is it Donkey? Yeah. Donkey or Wonky? Yeah, Donkey and Wonky. Oh, I think Wonky's in here as well. Tell you what we can do. Use technology. Drone it. Oh, good on it. I feel like they're not all here, so we're going to shut the drone up. See if they're all here or not. Oh. Yeah, they're there. There we go. So yeah, I'm currently using my drone to round up cows. It's working. Look, they're going to go through the gate, and then you'll see a drone just pop up. Saves us going around him, doesn't it? Not advise it, and that's definitely not going to become the norm. I think it's always better looking for cows with your own eyes. And you don't want your cows to be scared of a drone. You want them to film it. I think they'll come out. <laughs> but what we're doing here is we're making sure all the cows go that way. So these cows will follow to go around the gate and they'll go that way. Then we can bring them that way. If all these cows started to walk that way, the ones that aren't out of the field yet would follow them and there's no gate up there so we'd have an issue and wouldn't get them out. So 
that's why we're pushing everything this way to start with. Shut it! Well done, hi. Imo that we chat about quite a lot is Ben's daughter when she was here. Imo carved. And that's him. We're working with the bull here, so I always try and make sure that's why Heidi went around the bull's this side. Heidi go away from the bull because she's the least senior. I don't know what the other word for that is. Um, and me and Ben are the senior, so we do the bully stuff. That's gonna go fast. Go on, girl. So whilst moving stock, all 12 shooting vehicles coming at once. I love it, aren't you? Never a dull day. Never a dull day. Let's just get him down to this bit and I'll shout at you when I've got him down. Okay, cheers. All the commotion. I think there's 12 shooting trucks. I think we've got a bit of mud on there, so hopefully it's clear. If it's not, I apologise. <sighs> Cows are moving quite nicely. Come up. Hey, hey. <laughs> See how wet it's been in the last seven days? Well, you saw the field, but that's the dike and it's on the dike bank. Great. My dad's going to be fuming. Well, he is. But it's a bit of a bad job that we're getting used to it. They're moving up quite nicely, which is great. Steady girl. This is going quite well. Damn it! Damn it, touch wood! Touch wood. We know what happens when I say that. The guys are just shutting the gate that I opened. Oh yeah, we just got him in the corner near Hyman's. We're going to put him to the other one, so we're quite close to having him going. Okay. Cheers. Just informed Dad we're up to. So Hyde, you go around and get ready. Just go down the side of him and I'll go behind him. I hate moving stock over the road. You open that gate, Ben. Ha! Ha! Not coming out yet. I had to get that furthest away one. Whoop! Whoop! Get up! Ah, let him go. Let the car go. Take two. Boo! Get on! Come on! Get him! Move! Alright, steady, steady now! Oh. You jump in bad if you want. Get on! Slow down! Turn the red! Well done, Tom! Hey, they are, yeah. turn! Go up! And gone. Thank you. Nah. <sighs> Nothing. Told you I hate moving stock over the road. Guess you moving stock. It's the first time you've ever been on the road running. But they've not got these fields. They've got the 10 and 20 up there. So they've got 30 acres for about a week. And then after that week's done, we will. Um, be finished with silo, let's bring him in. All right, next job, get him in the 10 and 20 acre. Wish me luck. Neptune's been here for two sets, already on the brush. He's just mad for it. I think he's there to just watch out. Those guys are sorting those out. We just appreciate this. Mr. Nep has been here for, he remembers where it is. What a boy. I don't know about you guys, but I'm not cold anymore. No. I am. <laughs> I'm picking down the bedside and I get Dad to go there. 
yeah. on the track. I was saying before the start of this video, you can walk in slippers pretty much on this 10 days ago. I said yeah, seven, yeah. but probably 10. A lot of rain down. Where is that ginger? Messing about. <laughs> if you didn't hear that, I just went, I'm going where Neptune goes because he doesn't sink. I'm definitely not going to sink. I think she's trying to say Neptune's a big lad. Hide, right, just hold yourself. Hold yourself. Hide, no, no, no. <laughs> You've never played rugby or a team sport. Don't quite get in the middle of him. Oh no. No, you've got to hold it. You've got to be flat line with Ben. Have you never played rugby? You go up in a line. Whoever breaks the line, that's when they ruin it. Unless the attackers get through it. <sighs> it's not my first game with the egg ball. Come on, big lads. Oh, we have an appointment with Neptune's tail. Do not you dare. Dare you not? Do not go through there. Thank you. No, 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 sweet child of mine. Hey, hey, hey. Grab. Stay in the line. Ben, Ben. Come back a bit. How do people not know the line? He's so big. He's so chunky. What? Right, hide, yeah, you push on a bit. Keep him going. One, two, three, four, five, so five to six, 26. And some of the heifers are chasing the sheep. So they're gonna be on this paddock for, like I say, about seven days, and then we'll move them off. <laughs> Look at the fudge already. The usual spots for ditch field. Think of all them grass seeds. I think of all that life, yeah, all that work. It's down for the rain, it's flooded, flooded, flooded again. This is running but it's got to go down the level. At least we'll see if anything's bullying. Look how full that is. I know. Right guys, I'm going to end the video here. The surprise from cars, what I'm going to do is whenever this video's out, this will be a full video of me chasing cows. It'll be 10, 12 minutes long, so we're going to leave it there. Big thank you to the team once again. Uh, can't do it without the team. Second attempt wasn't first attempt this time, but I think last time was about five. The ginge is pissed off about weather. It's changed, hasn't it? One week. A week ago, we've sword lifted this field with that one. There's not showing any puddles in that one, that's good. This one, and I think that'll drain all right. This field I've done, and the far field, all our mowing grass we've done. And at the moment, it's not showing puddles in this field. But this water needs to go. This water needs to go. It's full to the top. When the surprise comes, you'll be, probably won't be very excited, but I think it's a very big uh, contribution. Have you seen those livestock down there? The ducks. The ducks. They want mopping up and shifting over somewhere else. And on that happy note, see you later. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Get your TP merch at pemtusfarmshop.kk slash TP merch. This stuff is coming out on the 23rd of October. If it's past that, if we've sold out, we will have a second date before Christmas, middle of November that I've got planned for two launches before Christmas. That is the plan. So please don't worry. Um, you'll get two chances. Uh, guys, thank you very much. See you in a bit. Bye. Oh dear. <laughs> Tell you what. I wish I had the effect on the females. I'm engaged now, so I don't need to. I've got mine. Put a ring on it. Boom.